all right y'all so we are about to get into my first get ready with me i know y'all like your yeah, first <laughs> i should have been doing all right but anyway like i told y'all we are coming with some banging content quality and some consistency okay all right so we're going to first um just get ready with me we're going to do hair makeup and outfit so stay tuned for that that's gonna be really fun so um if y'all don't know if y'all are new to my channel um i do have my own hair company it's called hollywood bundles i will have it all linked down in the description below and i also have it tagged somewhere on the screen um i need y'all to go follow my new um business hair page because my last one my phone was broke so i guess because i don't got that number no more i can't get into that account which i hope never happens again let me know down below like how could i not have that happen again because i don't want no number attached to a wedge so if i lose the number i lose my account <sighs> so you follow my new hair page and um yeah and make sure y'all buy y'all some hollywood bundles because this hair is amazing i'm not even going to do that first i'm going to start with my baby hairs um so we can yo i cannot believe i'll be watching some girls get ready with me and they start off with their makeup first oh i couldn't <laughs> not even if you paid me just you know give it a little sweep a slip i don't know what i want to talk about in this um <laughs> video but i think i'm gonna just talk about what's on my mind and lately what's been on my mind is heavy i'm a very spiritual being i just looked up y'all because people be literally just looking at my damn window weird creep stuff but anyway um king vaughn has been on my mind a lot lately i am a huge huge asian doll fan i've been a huge fan of her since she came out I always used to call her my wife, and then I started calling her my twin. Since the bitch train trying to get no bitch a rap, no raps, so she became my twin. So I've always been a huge fan of her. If anybody know me, know how I used to, how I used to feel about Lord Dirt. I actually got to meet him before, and let me know if y'all want to get that story time on that. I, that just came to my head. So if y'all want to get the story time on how I met Little Dirt the same time that i was like obsessed with him like how i am about little baby now that's how i was about little dirt when he came out um this ain't what you want yo um my homeboy so so rest in peace to my nigga he used to always we both love little dirt he used to always play um this ain't what you want every time i got on the stage when i was dancing he always used to know to play little dirt um i was cool with this girl before and we and me and her we was really like obsessed with Lord Dirk and uh that is just so much to, to tell about that I don't want to tell the story time but yes that was lit like I'm just thinking about that like it was litty as a titty all right y'all so I just did my baby hairs a little bit and I ain't even really had to do much I'm about to tie it back around so I'm gonna be looking like a hood rat a little bit for the some remain in the video comment down below if y'all want the Lord Dirk um freaking story man that shit was so lit but um anyway i've been a huge fan of dirk um i've known king vaughn i started knowing him through king i mean through little dirk first um literally when he first came home from jail i was watching their interviews about how he was gonna start rapping and stuff and honestly i'm not gonna lie i didn't think he was gonna blow up as much as he did i used to be like i, I remember when he first came out, i said yo motherfuckers not gonna listen to his music and usually I can depict if somebody gonna blow up or not. And I'm always right. Ask anybody that's friends with me or whatever. I'm always right about who I know gonna blow up and not. I was wrong about him. That's one thing I can admit and say I was wrong about King Vaughn. I ain't know he would be this famous. So yeah, I've been on him. My ex-boyfriend, like I'm a lot. I'ma use some bio silk, y'all, just a little bit. I'm gonna put it in my hair and we're gonna flatten his hair, y'all. I like my hair to be really, really bone straight. So I'm not gonna lie to you. I see one cramp. I'm literally gonna um I will freak out. Perfectionist, comment down below if y'all are perfectionist, cause I'm not gonna lie, it, it really kills you sometimes. It slow you down too in life because girl, everything is just not gonna be perfect. But I won't put nothing out, I won't do nothing if it's not perfect. Heard of King Vaughn um through dirt, of course. But like I said, 
I was also, I'm also a really huge Asian doll fan. And I'm gonna use my Remington flat eye. And we just wanna do the comb method, chase method, and just go through it. Yo, I wanted to do bone straight hair because I am a curl girl. I live for some Kim K curls. Um, if y'all didn't check out how to get the Kim K curls, I did it when I had the orange hair in my head. It's in my video, so go check it out. But I love um, freaking curls. So I was like, girl, switch it. Really said and by his death. And I don't know if it's because this is already an artist that I listen to. And I'm a really huge fan of his girlfriend. And it's like, I watched their whole relationship from the beginning to now. That shit broke my heart because instantly when I heard about it, I instantly thought about Asian doll. Like my heart broke for her. Cause people don't understand. And I would never want to understand that feeling of losing a soulmate or, or something like that. Like that is crazy. They had so many videos and pictures together. Even before he died, like they used that's all. That is, that is really, really crazy. I had watched the video a million times. I've watched the video a million times of his dev. Just to, you know, like I'm going to law school, so I really, I'm really, really good at like arguing, debating, coming to a a, 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 a debate with a, a, a folder like this thick, this big, and having all of the facts down. Like I'm very, 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 very good at that. And I'm a life path number nine. So if you in life uh, path number nine as well. One of your callings can be being a lawyer. So I flat iron it before I, um, after I do my makeup, not the whole shaboing that I'm doing now, but I'm still gonna go through it. After I do my makeup and right before I put on my outfit. I know Asian is like hurt, hurt. Do you understand me? Like hurt, hurt. Bitches been hating numbers on my face. Kick it to the curse, she ain't gang any bay. Agent on the beat, then the beat gets slayed. I took your defense, so watch what you say. Hi, bitch. Got a 30, don't try it. Ball up my own, when we do my shit. Give me, mm, -mm you die quick. I don't, mm -mm. I don't wanna kick it with a bitch for the height. Real pretty beat the ass in the street fight. You no know, fight like, like in the pink kite. Asian doll. <laughs> That's my bitch. Period. That's why I feel so like bad for her. Like, I wrote a post um, about, um, well, I made a post about her and Kima or whatever, what Kima had said, which is my baby mother. And I got a lot of likes on it because it was just so beautiful. Like, she said, I will share my son with you. Like, come on. You know how Asian feel to not have a piece of on? Then literally the same day she wrote that post, Asian was over there holding the sign. And, and I love to see that. Like, I love to see it. All right, y'all. So... I already did my head. We gonna bounce straight, Jack Black tonight. I'm about to do my eyebrows off camera to get into this makeup. I'm gang, I'm gang. All right, y'all. So I did my eyebrows and I got LA Girl Espresso on my eyelids, and I'm just gonna use this to black out any color. Pop in these bumps, so don't mind a black. Um, spot on my forehead, it was the biggest bump alive I ever had, and I had to because I'm a picker. This soft fall type of look, so we want to go with our browns, tans, oranges, you know, peaches, you know, type of look. So it's gonna be a really easy look. All I'm gonna do is boom, boom, bam. So I'm gonna go in with this literally burnt up a mess. But my BH Cosmetic bag. <laughs> I'm asking with my BH Cosmetic blending brush, one of my faves. And y'all, we literally gonna use these colors right here. All right, so I'm gonna start with my transition color. I'm gonna use this one. Put that in my transition. Being one stuff is really sad. Um, like this video and comment down below if you are a King Vaughn fan. I cannot wait to see what else happens like far as y'all gonna see. I ain't gonna talk too much, but y'all gonna see. It's gonna come out. No, orange is literally one of my favorite colors. I love orange. I've been loving orange since I was a kid. 
purple is my original favorite color. I have three favorite colors. Okay, get ready. Purple, royal blue, and orange. All right, y'all, now I'm gonna um, take a more in-depth blending brush and I'm gonna go in with the dark on orangey color. You know, put it where we put it out crease. It's definitely feeling like an orangey look today. Just make sure you blend everything out. Let me know I'm I love BH um, Studio Pro. Like, that never hit me before. How the fuck that just hit me? Oh, good thing. I'm gonna take this brown that's right here. I'm gonna dab it. Just a little bit. Cause we don't want that brown to take over that orange color. I know Dirk is hurting. You know, they call each other twin. And just imagine a person you feel like is your twin. It's some Lana and some eyelashes. to show y'all just a little cute little trick that's my face because i know y'all probably looking at my face like your face is oily y'all wouldn't believe i just got out the shower and dried my face it's nothing on my face look how oily you look i have very very oily skin so now i'm about to moisturize it <laughs> oh my god that fell my NYX Thinny Matte. This is the matte one, okay? I got the matte one and the dewy one. This is the matte one. Let that dry first, and then we're gonna go in with our primer. It's like to use this under my eyes because, like I said, I have really oily skin, so my eyes will still crease. So I like to use this under my eyes. And then I'm gonna use my poreless face primer. They both are poreless. Uh, Becca primer, like I said before. And y'all, I really just feel like us black people, black kings and queens, we need to really just stop um, killing each other. It's like, we don't need nobody to take us out. We doing it ourselves. You would think at the each death, people would um, learn. They don't learn. Now I'm going with my poreless. Oil on oh, my skin. But y'all, I'm going with my ass prime powder. Make sure y'all use a translucent powder. This is my favorite. You can get this $5 um, from Walmart, whatever. I'm going to use my e.l.f. brush. I said blush. And I'm gonna do this. And pat it on. And, and this is gonna make my makeup come out crazy for a second. Remember the steps I told y'all just now. And make sure you do the steps in the same order I did. Yes. You're gonna look crazy. Fancy beauty, and I'm gonna. I'm originally in the color 430, but 450 right now. Mm. All right, so mm -hmm. I just want to ask you. All right. Anyway, so why don't y'all do that, y'all? Mm, 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 mm. That's why I shouldn't have put a lot on the brush like I'm secret. Playing too much. So now I'm gonna go in with my favorite concealer, my Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Skin, 24 hour coverage. Foundation under my eyes, cause literally when you put foundation under your eyes, you're literally wasting your foundation because 
You're literally going over top of it with concealer. So now we just gonna blend everything out. Y'all do not mind my that horn. Like they are very, very ghetto. I live in a ghetto, all right? I'm from Baltimore, Maryland. I live in a ghetto. Ever since I was a kid, I always dreamed of being a superstar, being really, really big and making out of the ghetto, okay? I didn't get there yet. <laughs> but I am getting closer and closer as I stay consistent, okay? And in all of my future videos, y'all won't hear none of that in the background, okay? Be warm where I'm at. It's very sunny outside. Oh, I thought I seen something in the air. That was a tree. Oh my God. I thought I seen smoke. I can only imagine how crazy I fucking look. And from the north side where they raise wounds. I was in the trenches trying to see a left beyond it. Where I'm from, they turned their death into a contest. Ain't getting no damn non checks. My powder, my L'Oreal True Match, and I am in the color N6. Super blendable. I love this stuff. And if you haven't watched all my other videos, the reason why I do this, I will be I have really oily skin. My eyes will crease. Here's my translucent powder. And y'all don't mind, I'm going to chisel my face. We're going to get our color back and all that. Don't worry about that. And we just going to see what the air is my. I am only setting in. Well, I bake sometimes with it. This depends. Some of the best translucent ever. And it works on all shades of people. Powders and stuff. Making your nose run. My eyes be running, my nose be running, just every damn thing. I ain't know I was using my NARS concealer. My NARS concealer. And I, we are about to cut our cheeks, okay? We are about to cut. Yes, I do cream for contour and powder. But a lot of times I do just powder. But everybody not gonna have a natural contour line, okay? All right, so I'm going with my favorite contour kit. I'm so mad it's almost gone. Uh, I'm about to go buy me one, another one, like ASAP. Um, and I'm gonna use this. Like I said, I'm not gonna use no cream. And we just, but I already got a contour. Y'all see that? Like, uh, and then we just gonna, you know. Y'all gonna see, like I already have a natural contour, but y'all gonna see how this just give it the, uh. Cause that give you more of like a chiseled look, you know? Nick told y'all I'ma bring that color back to my But I need y'all to subscribe to my channel. Like I'm really trying to hit a huge goal before the year's over. And with the power of God manifestation and support, I know it's possible. I'm not gonna say the goal, but if I hit it, well when I hit it, that's how you gotta talk. When I hit it. Before the years out, I'm gonna tell y'all, y'all helped me and we got there and it was manifested. And like, yeah, it worked, period. Your smile, you gotta make sure you do black. I'm gonna go in with my Sasha Buttercup because I am not gonna use air smile um, to cut my, what's the name? I don't want to leave no type of streaks, marks, splash fit. Which you don't you leave on your what's the name? But I'm just a darker skin person, so I'm not even playing those games. Get you know that look that you're going for, you know. With my black opal finishing powder, I love it. Lux. Um, I'm in the color zero five zero deep. Just because as chocolate girls, brown girls, we don't want, you know. And trust me, I have one out light before. Oh. See? Just, 
I should have did it before I just put that black opal powder on, well, you know. Get my little nose a button. So I'll go in and my blush palette. And I'm about to go with this. And with these two false highlighters and this is in gleaming blush face powder y'all see how pretty this is i love it just i want my highlight to be beaming i see how gorgeous that is After I did my um baby, my freaking bling. Oh, look at that. Gorgeous. 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 My freaking makeup is, I said makeup. Well, of course, my makeup, but I fall soft makeup. Look. This is gonna come out crazy, but yeah, I'm going with my NK um, lip liner, and this is in Coco NYX Butter Gloss. This is about to run out again. This is my favorite. Fortune Cookie is a fave too, but I just didn't want to wear with this look. Fortune cookie it is. Just gonna mix it a little bit. Alright y'all, so I'm gonna go with my NYX. And I'm going to spray it. Whew. And we are about to get in to this is so gorgeous now we are about to get into um the outfit Very pretty, right? Look at the pearls. I love how it's only pearls right here, and then you know, gold hallway. I love gold hallway. So this is a baby. Don't mind my velvet um, hangers. That's all I like. I like to use. So we're gonna put that right there. So I don't know if I'm gonna even do this seat through. Can I get something? Like Anyway, I don't know. So I'm gonna either wear this. This I love the material. Very gorgeous. Y'all gonna see how cute it looks. But I don't know what shirt I'm gonna wear. I'm either wear this. Let's get a little turtleneck wraps. Or I'm gonna do whatever one looks better. We're gonna see. And then I'm going to wear. I see where I'm going to wear these heels that I got from Fashion Nova. And they got the drawstring really, really pretty. So let's get dressed. Okay, you guys, so this is the outfit. This is a nice fall gorgeous look. Y'all, I love gold. I'm gonna show y'all my shoes and everything as I back up. Um, like I said before, I got this bag. I think from Forever 21. Got this from Fashion Nova. Um, my shoes are from um, Fashion Nova as well. Um, 
my anklets are from Sheen and I think these two on this ankle is from the booty. Our Indian hair, very flowy, very gorgeous bundles, very chill. Got the makeup popping. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you enjoyed this, get ready with me. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, leave your comments down below. Also, give this video a thumbs up. Did I just not just say that three times? Ha! Anyway, make sure you share the video as well. Um, if y'all want some more get ready with me, make sure you comment down below and let me know. Also, follow all of my social media. Um, all of my social media being linked down in the description below. Um, I will be getting all of y'all DMs, comments, or whatever. So, just let me know what y'all want to see and if y'all really enjoyed this video. So, without further ado, I'm about to go out with my girls. And we're about to have some drinks and we're about to have some fun. So, I will see you guys later. Bye.